Hello and welcome to the debut review. My name's Taylor, let's get started. Kim So Hee is a new female soloist, debuted on May 19th, 2017 with her first single, Spotlight. You might recognize So Hee as a contestant on their survival show K-Pop Star 6 as a part of the JYP team, and she was extremely close to winning, making it as a semi-finalist. So he is now a member of the rookie girl group Elris, and you might be like, but Taylor, why didn't you make a video on Elris? Well, that's because So he debuted as a solo artist before the rest of the group. Personally, I think this was a bad move because Sohi is immediately more popular than the other Elvis members, and I think she should have debuted as a soloist when Elvis had some credits under their belt already. Sohi has also expressed that she regrets debuting as a solo artist before her other members, but it's the company's decision in the end. Sohi is signed to Hoonis Entertainment, the same label as Top Dog. This company unfortunately has an awful reputation for underpromoting and mistreating their artists, so let's hope they don't screw this one up. She is currently 17 at the time of debut. There wasn't much promotion for Spotlight aside from a teaser video. In fact, Hoonis even pushed the release date back for a super vague reason. I wish we would have gotten some teaser photos or more social media hype because Hoonis viewed this as their opportunity to gain attention for Elvis' debut and it didn't really accomplish that. Alright, let's check out the video. The music video for Spotlight was uploaded to One The Case and Elvis' YouTube channels on April 19th. This video is very high quality and filmed in a creative way. It's essentially a video of Sohi dancing, but multiple different sets are used and the transitions between these sets are what makes the video visually interesting. All the sets are cool as well because none of them are too contrasting and the whole video has this mysterious dark vibe to it. Sohi's an amazing dancer as well, so I like that her dance skills are really highlighted in this video. So his styling really stands out to me. She goes through quite a few outfits, all of them crop top and sweatpants combo, and while some of them are casual, some of them are chic as well. I think they successfully presented her as a mature artist. I like the look of this video overall, and I think it introduces Sohi's talents well. Spotlight is a dynamic dance track with an 80s sound to it. I like the lyrics to this song, it's about a dream where two lonely people fall in love. It's not the most risky song for a debut, but it does a good job of displaying Sohi's vocal range. Her voice is light and sweet, and while I do think a different style of song would better suit her voice, Sohi is obviously a strong singer from her time on K-pop star until now. This song is a single album, and in this case, I don't really have a problem with it being a single. If so, he continues with her solo career, however, I hope mini albums or EPs are released instead. Sohi held her debut stage on May 21st at Inkigayo. The set was really cool here and obviously personalized, but seriously, I do like the huge Sohi backdrop. Actually, the entire look of the stage was very dynamic and dreamlike. I absolutely love her outfit for this stage. It's very interesting and looks great on her. You wouldn't think this outfit would be easy to dance in, but Sohi makes it look super simple. The choreography and dancing here is one of the high points of the debut. The song really lends itself to lots of detailed choreography, and along with her backup dancers, Sohi was an amazing performer. Her live vocals are good as well, and Sohi definitely sounds like the track. To my knowledge, this is Sohi's only official performance of Spotlight, aside from a showcase stage as well. Her promotional period was pretty non-existent, and it would have been beneficial to promote live for two weeks instead or appear on multiple programs. But from this stage alone, Sohi was able to show what a great live performer she is. I'd recommend Sohi to those of you who like female soloists with strong dancing skills, like Faye or Boa. I'd say this is a good start to Sohi's solo career. Her skills in dancing were really showcased here, both in the video and the debut stage. Also, the stylist for this debut did a wonderful job giving her similar outfits with different levels of glamour. And Sohi killed it at her first stage, showing her live talent. But there are some low points to this debut, and unfortunately most of it falls on the company, Hoonis Entertainment. It's super uncommon to have a member's solo debut directly before the group debut, and I don't really understand why they did it this way. Also, showcasing Sohee on more than one music program would have helped both Sohee and Elris gain popularity. 
Finally, there should have been more social media promotion for this debut, especially teaser photos. But what do you guys think? Is Sohi in the spotlight as one of your fave female artists? I honestly don't know if we can expect more solo work from her for a while. I think this solo debut was mostly organized to gain publicity for Elvis, but there are a lot of other ways to do this. But now, let's support Sohi in her solo and group activities. If I didn't cover something or you have any questions, let me know and I'll answer you no problem. Check the description for more information on Sohi and keep an eye out for my video on Elris. Please subscribe for more debut related content. Thanks for watching!